what you need to know about property tax protesting companies in 2020. Hey, I'm Eric Peterson, broker and owner of Copa Real Estate here in Austin, Texas. You know, it's only January and we're at least already seeing hand wringing in our neighborhood about protesting property taxes and some of the companies that will protest property taxes for you. So here's the deal. What we do know is that protesting your taxes in Williamson County and Travis County are likely going to be even more difficult this year. Property values have really increased in the last year. And in addition, it seems like these taxing entities are focused on collecting as much money as they possibly can and buttoning up some of the ways that uh, people have been able to help uh, reduce their property tax burden in the past. So here's something that you should know. If you have engaged one of these property tax protesting companies in the past, the agreement that you signed probably said that they're going to protest for you that year and every year after that. So in other words, if they protested for you in 2019, you probably authorized them to protest again for you in 2020. Now that's fine if that's what you intended, but what we found is that many of our clients and friends didn't realize that that's what they were signing. So check what you signed or reach out to those companies because if you intended to do it on your own this year or maybe hire a different company, well, that other company, if you've authorized them to do it, they're already going to be protesting on your behalf and you might wind up owing them some money. Second thing this year, this is a big change, is that at least one of the property tax protesting companies is going to be charging an upfront fee or a fee whether they're successful for you or not. Apparently that they were probably protesting for a lot of people in the last couple of years that really didn't have a chance of being successful. And so they're uh, now finding that they need to charge that fee. Whether that fee is uh, correct or not, I don't know. I'm not making any judgments on their business policy. Only wanted to let you know about it so that if you didn't intend to be paying that fee, you should, be, you should uh, go ahead and cancel that service immediately before they start the process for you. This message is not intended to be negative towards any of the property tax protesting companies. In my opinion, many of these companies provide a valuable service to homeowners who either don't have the skill or the time to protest your property taxes yourself. As always though, make sure that you understand what you're signing, read everything thoroughly before you sign any contract. Hey, what questions do you have about protesting your property taxes or property taxes in general? Whenever you're ready, if you have a question, give me a call 512-791-7473 or send me an email at eric at Thanks for watching and make it a great day.